Good afternoon, traders. It is Friday, May 31st, 2024, and the U.S. stock market is closed. You're looking at the Dow here. Dow had a terrific run today, uh, uh, up, 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 and then this huge spike up last 15 minutes of day. The Dow closed up 575 points. That was the best. Uh, this is the best day the Dow has had since last December. Uh, and I tried to find to research today and find out just why it did that. I can find no rational reason why it did it. Maybe it was just trying to make things look good at the beginning, end of the month. The, the, the markets will do that sometime. Anyway, big up day in the Dow. We had a good day. Uh, at the beginning of the day, we closed out positive $17,000 in 10 positions earlier this morning. That was real good, but you notice that the, you know, the Dow was just diddling down here when that happened. Uh, our problems started actually when all this big upside movement was taking place. Um, we clo We are carrying negative... $5,000 in eight positions. Now that doesn't sound too bad. However, we were earlier up to positive 10,000 and it went to negative five because of one lousy stock. And I'll show you that in a second, but let me show you the best first of all. This, the best was R-E-N-T which is Rent the Runway, and we had bought this yesterday, second hour or so. It made this high, and then I kind of complained yesterday it had pulled back. Well, this morning it gapped way up, actually took out this high over here, and we ended up exiting this thing almost at the high tick of the day and consequently took out took out positive $11,000 in rent the runway. So this was just a great trade. Unfortunately, after having such a great trade, we had an extremely lousy trade. And I'll show you that too. This is in C, uh, excuse me, CSLR, which is Complete Solaria Incorporated. And we had bought this in the middle of the day yesterday, and then we exited this morning uh, about break even. And we would have been fine if we just left it alone, but it's going along. And when all that upside movement in the Dow was taking place, this thing pops up here, and we get in right there with about 90 minutes to go, and then the thing just collapses from there. So we end up holding negative. $13,000 in Complete Solar Solaria Incorporated, and that just screwed us. It took that, you know, $10,000 profit that we had in our open trade and reduced it to negative five that we are carrying. So, uh, frustrating, freaky Friday. Listen, you guys have a great weekend, and I will be back here trading on Monday as usual.